you smoke, just come up for a second. Come here. This young woman, I walked in. Quietly, we don't announce it. That's for, you know, security person reasons over there. I walked in. She's behind the counter, and she didn't know I was coming. And she goes, it's President Trump. She looks at me, it's President Trump. You saved my college. And I said, how the hell do you know that? She said, you are. She gave me a kiss. I said, I think I'm never going back home to the First Lady. <laughs> you were supposed to keep that quiet. See, now, for the average politician, that's death. For me, I don't care. I just want to tell you, you are an unbelievable person with a great personality. You lit up the whole room. You lit up the whole room. I said, weeks later, I'd go, who is that person that was so incredible? She knew everything about me. She had no idea I was coming. She knew everything about me. And you know, the historically black colleges and universities, I gave millions and millions, billions of dollars to. They kept coming back. And I said, why are you doing this? And we gave them long-term funding. And she knew that because she said her college, which was, she loved her college. She said it was so great, right? You loved it. The illustrious CAE. Yeah, that's right. She loved her college, and she said, you saved my college. What was your college? Tell them. The illustrious Clark Atlanta University. And, and it was so impressive, and I felt so good, because she really did. She really said, I said, did you like the college? She said, no, I loved that school. I loved that college. And that's what it's all about. But you are an incredible person. I think you have a tremendous future. I really do. Thank you. And I'll do whatever I can to help you, okay? Thank you, Dan. Thank you very much. Great job. Thank you. You want to say something else? Man, no. you know, I thought I was done. <laughs> but I do want to add on to some of the remarks that were made by others, and we do need to do our best to get the message out there. The fight is nothing if all we do is talk about it amongst ourselves. So with that being said, since you said you'd help me, shameless plug, if y'all need anybody to knock doors, make phone calls, wave signs, get people out to the polls, call me at Conserve the Culture. Because not only do I mobilize the HBCU students so that they may get this message, but I'm the best person when it comes to black engagement in the black community. And nobody needs this message more than my folks. So if, do y'all care for real? Are y'all with us for real? ConserveTheCulture.com for any and all inquiries. Y'all can follow me at Miss Kayla, baby. I'm going to give it back to Big T. And last thing, make sure you guys tune in to my podcast dropping soon on the Patriots Prayer Network. Thank you all. She's great. Thank you. That's, that's a great person, great woman. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. From the moment we 